has a holly jolly Christmas New Year. Way, eh, 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 eh. Now can we play tic-tac-toe? Mm -hmm. Yay! You want to be the candy canes or the wreaths? Um, wreaths. Okay, you go first. <laughs> you won! See, one, two, three, tic-tac-toe. What right here? Yep. Yay! We both win. What's this bull doing in my kitchen? It's a very rainy Friday afternoon, y'all. We're about to make a lemon cake. We're gonna use this box of lemon cake mix, but we're gonna spruce it up. We have this creamy lemon supreme frosting, but we're not using this. Titus got that. He's actually the one who bought the cake mix and the frosting because that restaurant that we ate at last week, we got a piece of lemon cake for dessert and it was amazing. And ever since then, we wanted a lemon cake. Of course, we don't know their recipe and we do have a homemade lemon cake recipe, but he just grabbed this while he was in the store. So we're going to use it. I wonder if they would give me their recipe because that was seriously the best lemon cake I've ever had. It was almost pound cake like and I, I was going to make just a lemon pound cake, but it's not exactly like a pound cake. It was wonderful. The next time we go there, I'm gonna ask them, is it a secret recipe or can they share it? Here's what we're gonna do for this box mix to make it a little better. First of all, I am gonna make it a two layer cake. If y'all wanna see the Southern little layer cake that we made the day after Christmas, it had 10 layers. I'll link that video down below. That was amazing. We'll go ahead and get the pans ready. After school today, I got the living room dusted and vacuumed and vacuumed stairs and upstairs. Once again, they're saying we might get some snow in a few days. I'm just not even going to expect it this time. I'm going to expect no snow and maybe we will get just a little bit. Just want to see it one time, you know, once every winter. Just, just once. Okay, we'll sit these over here. So we start, of course, with the cake mix. So the first thing the box calls for is a cup of water. We're gonna use a cup of buttermilk. You can use regular milk instead of buttermilk. And like I said, you can do one or all of these things and it'll make it seem more like a homemade cake. So the next thing is a third of a cup of vegetable oil. We are gonna use the vegetable oil, but you can substitute it for melted butter instead of the oil if you want to. Since we're doing the buttermilk, just knocked over some olive oil, it's fine, it didn't spill. <laughs> Since we're doing the buttermilk and we're gonna add an extra egg, we're gonna stick with the oil for this one. The next thing is the eggs, it calls for three, we're gonna do four. If you add an extra egg, it makes your cake a lot more moist. You doing the Andy Griffith show? No, that, uh, Oh, it's a secret spy whistle, okay. The secret spy also came in here with the Colby Jack. Guess he's throwing some secret spy hints that he wants a piece of cheese. <laughs> so once we get this cake in the oven, we're gonna go ahead and make the frosting and put it in the refrigerator. It's gonna be a whipped cream, lemon cream frosting. Jonah's got an idea. There are the eggs. You can also add pudding mix, but I don't have any, so I used it for that banana pudding the other day but instant lemon pudding or instant vanilla pudding will work great for a lemon cake. You can also add a little lemon extract if you want to, but I don't want mine to be any more lemony than what they have it, so we're not gonna add any extract, but you can if you want it more lemony. For the frosting, we're gonna make a lot of it. Since we're making a two layer cake, I wanna have enough for the outside and enough for the, you know, in between the two layers. So we're gonna use three cups of heavy cream. And we're gonna go ahead and start whipping this and I'm gonna get a lemon, squeeze out a couple of tablespoons of lemon juice and get some lemon zest from it. And while this is whipping, we'll just add that in. Then we'll add some powdered sugar. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, it's starting to get thick, so we're going to go ahead and add in some powdered sugar. I'm going to start with half a cup. We're going to put half a cup more of the powdered sugar, so a cup and a half, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be the thickness we want. That is so good. That is the number one thing. Like, if you don't change anything from the cake mix, to me, the number one way to make a box cake mix better is to do a homemade frosting. Even if you leave the cake the same, that homemade frosting is going to take it up about 10 notches. See that? It's perfect. Still really soft and fluffy, but it's thick enough that it's going to stay on the cake really good. So we'll just put this in the refrigerator, and then when the cake layers have completely cooled, we'll frost it. We'll go ahead and cook supper while we're waiting. Simple supper tonight. Fish, shrimp, the already battered and ready for you kind. Slaw. I am going to make the slaw and some waffle fries. For the slaw, we have just some shredded angel hair, green cabbage. We're going to put in some of these minced onions, salt and pepper, and I think I'm, you want some green bell pepper in the slaw, Daddy? Or no? It don't matter, baby. Well, you, tell me what you want. You want green bell pepper or no? I'm not. Okay. <laughs> that just makes it easier for me. Oh, and we put a little bit of sugar. And then the mayonnaise, and that's it. Since I'm using the minced onion this time, I'm not putting any garlic powder or onion powder. If I don't use minced onion, I usually put those. You can, of course, put, you know, finely chopped fresh onion in there, too. That's it. Once we get enough mayonnaise in here. I thought I got waffle fries. I remember I switched it to crinkle cut french fries instead of the waffle fries. We have butterfly shrimp and then just this crispy batter fish. I want to have a pretty thick middle layer, so what I'm going to do is put this in the refrigerator with this thick middle part and put the frosting back in the refrigerator and then we'll come back and put the other layer on top once this really sets up here. That's some drums for you. Play a tune, son. He told me to draw some of his size. Well, that's too many stuff. See how you do it? Play it. Daddy. What, you want me to draw something else? Yeah, but that is too many stuff, do it? It is? Yeah, it is. What else you want me to draw? Good at making drums, Daddy. Okay. Need some drumsticks. You know that. You see something wrong with that? Yeah. Okay. Maybe hmm, circle drums. You don't like this one? Yeah, that one has you lines hate, on it. You hate that one? Yeah. Okay. I I just want a circle one, not okay. that, not okay. that yarn one. I, I'm not offended that you said. You yeah. can have it. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah! Like that? Is that what you after? Yeah, just okay, one. Okay, now here's your drumstick. You want one drumstick or two? Just one? Two. 